So, I have this area in the demo where the player has the ability to explore a little. The scene is lacking life. I want to have people moving around and interacting with the world. I haven't implemented all the things for the player to do yet, but I will keep that a secret for you to discover for yourself. I first want to implement a pathing system, so I created this actor that can add path points around the map and created this path around the scene for testing. I then gave the ability to the actor to detect points and move along the given path. But once he reaches the end, he stops, which is useful for some situations. I then add the ability to walk back to where he came from once he reaches the end path, kind of like a patrol. he would just walk back and forth. However, I noticed an issue. If I want the actor to have a looped path, he simply walks back the long way round. So I added the option to make the actor to go back to the first point when he reaches the end of the path. I then left him there roaming around until his feet bled for an eternity. <laughs> Another issue happens when the player obstructs the path. The actor kinda doesn't know how to handle the situation. I want the player's capsule to affect the navigation, so I changed these settings within the project settings, and now the player affects the nav mesh, causing the actor to find a different way around the player. For now I'm happy with the path system, but I want to implement random roaming as an option for the actor. With this simple code, an actor has the ability to select random points in the nav mesh and move around freely. As you can see, he kind of just wanders around aimlessly. I want to give him the ability to interact with something if he is within a certain radius. I decided to go with sitting. I downloaded this animation from Mixamo.com and modeled a chair to fit the animation. I ported it into game and added it to its own actor blueprint and made the logic for the actor to sit if he is within a certain radius of the chair actor. It works, except it doesn't. I place a bunch of other chairs and actors in the scene. Check out what happens. Strange, right? So after many hours later, implementing fixes and a 1 in 5 chance of choosing to sit down, the actors roam around freely and sit down if they want to. So combining this with random roaming and pathing logic, the scene feels a bit more alive. There is still loads more to add, more interactions, points of interest, random idle animations, etc. I will build on this system in the next video. Thanks for watching.